they both have a congenital disorder that has affected the eye uh, since birth and led to an increase in the eye pressure since birth. Uh, basically, uh, when we have an increase in eye pressure, it's like similar to have an increase in blood pressure. That's you have a hypertension. Uh, when you have an increase in eye pressure, that leads to a condition that's called glaucoma. And when that happens for children since birth, that's when we say a congenital glaucoma. Sadly, they already had several procedures before, but they were not successful and the eye pressure continued to increase and that has severely compromised their visual acuity and both of them had at least one eye lost because of that high pressure. She has a congenital type of glaucoma, it's autosomal dominant, so her sister has it as well. And uh, it, eventually you can get angle closure, which he's gotten at a very young age. Um, so we're going to, he's already had a surgery, we're going to do a new surgery, put in an Ahmed valve, see if we can lower his pressure. Just been talking to his doctors so they know how to maintain his, his healing phase and you know, and ultimately give them the best success at this surgery. After a week since he was born, um, they made a surgery here in the city, in Deir Zor, and it was really bad surgery because um, uh, there, was, there were no um, like uh, good equipment, and uh, one of his eyes it was like blank. Guys, Dr. I was. So now I'll take the needle. So uh, it's a good thing that uh, we managed to see those two children uh, at this stage, at least to help salvage the good eye and preserve whatever uh, visual accuracy remains they have, so they can continue their life. They're still two children, they still have future ahead of them, we also hope for them for a better future.